What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Let's Play Dead Space. Now, this is going to be the final recording session, finally. Again, it's not that I haven't been enjoying this game, it's just that it's been a bit of a pain in the ass to actually record this and find time for it, but, you know, it's, that's not here or there. Also, the fact that only, like, five people watch this, but, you know, that's not important. Anyway, so, uh, before we actually begin this, um, so last time when the red marker actually appeared, I was mentioning that there was a cell chanting, and... I did put in editing what that chanting uh, translates to, and it's, a it's Latin. But um, I need to correct something and put it on record. So first of all, we're going to be using OBS really quickly to do something. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can't find this shit. All right, bring this up. Yep, okay, good. Now we're just gonna, I'm just going to switch screens. Let's see, where the hell is... Oh, I'm in the wrong menu, no wonder. <laughs> Oops. All right. Just a moment as I figure this bullshit out. There we go. Alright. And there we go. So this is what I look at when I record, by the way. Uh, this is my second monitor. So, uh, down here, this is a bunch of trivia for the Dead Space uh, Site 3A, mar or, yeah, Marker 3A. 3A is referred to at, or is a reference to what this marker is. As it turns out, there's actually a lot of stuff going into this. Like, more than... I initially thought it's weird. I had to track this shit down. It none of this information is on the regular red marker page. It's just on the marker three A page. But yeah, um, I just want to quickly reiterate. Yeah, th this is what it refers to with, or this is what the translation of the uh, chanting is, or about it is what they're saying. This here is what it translates to. I find this to be personally um, pretty fucking nuts because um, that has some pretty heavy implications about it. Hmm. All right, let's bring it back up. Sorry, it's only some. God damn, my diaphragm is just dying today for some reason. All right, now we're just gonna jump back into the game. I think it's uh this one. Yep. Okay, but yeah, that's pretty pretty fucking nuts. I gotta say, just like what that entails. Um, in terms of, so it, the chanting is inside of Isaac's head. That's probably like the most prominent part I want to mention. It's all in Isaac's head. Like, it's not um. He's not actually hearing it because there's no way for him to actually hear it. Oh, by the way, being one of my uh, Nakamores, because of course we are. Now, it's been a little while since I've touched this game because, um, unlike my usual stint of just not getting around to it, this time I've actually been on vacation. Uh, this time, uh, hang on a second, there's a volume a bit. I was in vacation in Utah, actually, so, uh, I was a little out of state, so I didn't really have a chance to actually do a lot of other stuff with this. Wow, you guys are just persistent, aren't you? I'm finding using, okay, so using the Ripper to go for the leg seems to be a very efficient method, actually. It really slows them down. And they're dead. <laughs> Hero's worried about, I have to actually put effort into this. Nah, not so much. And you're gonna die. That hit stun that you get with the Ripper already seems to be pretty effective. Ah, this is not bad. It seems once you get the damage upgrades for the Ripper, you actually do stand a good chance with it, so... That's pretty good. I, I like that. Alright, also before we move on, I uh, was quickly looking around before we started recording and uh, got this over here. Plus we cut our energy, that's good. Uh, is there anything else in here we need? I don't believe so. Yeah, um, the last week I was going to actually finish recording Dead Space, but I ended up actually spending a week out in Utah with visiting Taylor's uh, grandparents. That's pretty cool. I like Utah. For anyone who is watching this that's uh, native of Utah or lives there or knows at the place, yeah, that's pretty cool. I just don't, I'm not a big fan of how many Mormons there are, but you know, that's slightly irrelevant information. Alright, so, if I'm, actually there is a thing I want to do really fast before we get too far into this. I'm going to dock the shuttle. Yep, here we go. Oh, uh, guys, I, it's been too long since I actually looked at the lore for this fucking franchise. I've been so... So, last time I was wrapped up in Yu-Gi-Oh, this last two weeks, or last week, at, namely... God damn it. I've been really into the Fate Stay Night series again, so... My, my brain's a little more wrapped up in that right now, but... I can try to pay attention to this. Alright, so there's something in particular I'm looking for. Uh, I'm gonna think I mentioned the, pa the Pang Trophy when I was here last time. Uh, now... Thankfully, this time around, we're going to be entering 0G, actually, once we get a little far into this. Actually, I might already be able to use it. Nope, not so much. Okay, so we need to swing around that way. I'm going the complete wrong way, but 
Then again, actually, I want to say it's like somewhere down here. Isn't it? Yes, there it is. I see it. And come on. Nope. Oh, come on. I know you can get that. There we go. <laughs> For those who are confused about what I just picked up, that is the Pang Trophy. Pang is a thing that appears in every Dead Space game. At least as far as my knowledge, the main Lion Trilogy. And you get a trophy every time you get it. I don't know what the hell it is. Or you mean like trophy lies in like achievements and stuff like that. I have no idea what the hell it refers to. I'm pr I'm pretty sure it might be an, an in-joke amongst the developers because Visceral Studios is fucking cool like that. There's always paying. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to look into that, actually. I'm, that's not something I'm immediately familiar with. Anyway, so... Like last time, we, we still have marker navigation to go on. So this would be exciting. <laughs> uh, then again, I'm a little low on bolts right now. I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit concerned, but I shouldn't be too bad off for the time being. Real that. I seriously also have to invest heavily in uh, reload times for my weapons. Then again, we're kind of at the end game, so... Not certain if I actually have the time to do it or not. Oh, you know what? I should... I just realized I should probably also close out Chrome, because it's probably going to eat some of my CPU. No, I didn't say close, you asshole. Okay, there we go. So I'll make sure I do that before I get too invested in here so I don't get any frame drops. Because that's the last thing I need. Alright, so. Gravity control. Fun stuff. By the way, I turned the quality down on the shadows a little bit just so I can conserve a little more CPU because... I don't know, Death Space is a game from like 2009-2010. There's no reason it should be eating up 55% of my CPU. I, I don't get that. This, this PC can handle running Overwatch on pretty decent settings, so... Uh, I don't... I have no idea what's going on with that. Anyways, so this shit. Uh... It's not necessarily an escort mission, but... Maybe a little bit on the rougher side. Also, I just remembered that there's, no, there's not really a point having the, the settings too high up, because... Well, I, I've proven that the PC port is kind of a lazy piece of shit sometimes, so... Yeah. I don't know. I think they kind of just ported the Steam at a certain point when PC gaming wasn't too big at the time. I mean, it was, but it wasn't as big a priority as, like, you know, actual console games. At least that's what I'm finding. I do like how there's a bunch of this shit just flying around, though. It's kind of cool. Alright, anyway, so enough of uh, lollygagging. <laughs> Fucking lollygagging. Let's go ahead and get the shit activated. That's the track I need to activate. God damn it. Not quite. Actually, uh... Sorry I keep doing this, folks. I kind of just jumped into this recording session. Ah, you're really that low? God damn it. Alright, let's put you like... One? Three, two, one. There. Okay, I just had to adjust the volume so it's not like loud in my ears so I can hear myself talk. Alright, anyway. So. Ah, oh, it's too low. <laughs> this is bothering me. Alright, it should be good. Okay. Sorry, last minute tweaks. I, I shouldn't touch this anymore, and I'm going to keep myself from doing so. Alright, so here we have the marker. And I hear noises. I already got leapers. Or lurkers. So, God, there's a lot of them, actually. Holy crap. Um, okay. <laughs> Dead. There's a couple in the ceiling behind me. Should be too big of a hassle. Uh, uh, damn. Can't get a clear shot. Alright, quick adjustments, quick adjustments, that's what the cell is all about. You assholes. Oh yeah, some more on the sides, I wonder. I'm trying very hard, I didn't even see you down there. I'm trying very hard to weave between their shots, but it's not the easiest thing in the world. Alright, chopped off one of those. Line gun might serve me well here, actually. Alright, one. Not good. Dodge that one nearly. There's still you on the side. Oh yeah, there we go. That's a lot better. Woohoo! Okay. Ah, oh, I could have used the explosive canisters. Why did I think about that? I think I didn't really see it, so... Eh, that's kind of on me. Alright, so now that all these assholes are finally dead. Yeah. Fucking cunts. Alright. Uh, now we can get this shit going. So, yeah, I mentioned this isn't really an escort mission, but every time you advance this thing a little bit, you're going to be jumped by a, a assortment of different necromorphs. So, be wary of that, keep it cool, and you should be okay. 
Then again, Nakamores are always very loud when they jump in, so you're not going to be exactly ambushed. I think it's like every time you get through a corner, you get jumped. Roughly. And good. Okay. Let me see if I can't figure this out. Alright, so I know you have to get this into... There's a ship right there. Got this conveyor belt. Alright, so you flip this thing around. I believe this is how it goes. Yeah, okay, I got this. Grab onto it. Thank God the tether actually works now. <laughs> Jesus, I don't know what the hell is going on on the Kellyan. It's called, I think it was called the Kellyan. I guess it's been a while since I looked at Dead Space. I've been so focused on other shit for uh, recent times. Alright, so take that off. Now because this is too wide, we can't just uh, turn the line here. We have to drag this off a little bit. And it's just uh, automatically, I think I'm going to be ambushed. No? Okay then, I guess we're fine. Uh, call me surprised. Alright, bring it back. Also, the Necromorphs have been surprisingly quiet, considering I'm on the verge of bringing the red marker back. Actually, it's weird that Necromorphs are trying to attack me when I'm trying to bring the fucking thing back. I don't get that. I also don't get why the Necromorphs aren't trying to... Oh, there you go. There we are. I don't get why the Necromorphs aren't trying to reach Convergence, because... That's kind of the design of the markers. They're literally just like satellite points from the moons. So, I don't know. That's odd, but alright. There we go, you. Come on. There we go. And again, don't, don't, never wait for the item to fully retract you. As soon as you have a you have a grip with your kinesis on items that you grab from a distance, just press the A slash X button. You're pretty much good. And... Give the mirrors open. This is why I actually did want to keep my volume a bit, a bit, so I can actually listen for when these assholes are coming in. Alright, and this is lined up properly. And more dudes. Hey, I got plasma cutter ammo. Oh, yeah. It sounds like more leapers? No, lurkers. Shit, take that one. Well, so I got level 4 suits, so what do I care? Oh. Ah, damn, it didn't even slow him down. Shit, chucked at them. Yeah, I don't know why I'm not using my fucking line rack. Damn it. Line gun. Whatever. Woo! Woo -hoo. Okay. By the way, uh, Happy New Year's, folks. This is actually my first recording session of the new year, and if I'm not mistaken, I think this video will be going up on this week's Thursday because I'm kind of behind. So that's good. Um, by the way, can I not get this in here yet? Uh, let's have to bring it on there. No, I shouldn't have to bring it on there. What the hell? Are you not done? Oh, no, it's not all the way in yet. No wonder. There we go. And only minimal distractions. Okay, it's in position. Still having trouble with these damn loading controls. <laughs> Isaac, restore gravity to the room. I should be able to load the marker then. Okay, okay. <laughs> because we're in zero gravity, uh, I'm going to jump up there really fast. Perspective! God's music, though. I'm gonna miss playing Dead Space 1, though. I do really like this game. Now that I have this experience on me, I could probably play this game on higher difficulties, but I don't know if that's in me pressing consider or not. I mean, I could totally go for the trophies, but... I don't know. As a recent, I haven't been touching my PS3 at all because I've been so focused on my PS4. And I don't have enough wires to readily switch between the two, so... I don't know. Anyway, enough of my mindless rambling. Where am I going? Oh yeah, I grabbed the controls. Duh. Should be over there, right? Shabushki. There we go. Ugh, like a sore. Shit. Alright, jump down here, and this should be it. Always looking for shortcuts, guys. Definitely always looking for shortcuts. Yep. It's good to know we're finally on the same page. Unfortunately, 9 times out of 10, when someone's on the same page as Isaac, they end up dying. So, yeah. I I'm not spoiling too much with that. That's just a given fact. And the reason being is this is going to be made pretty clear soon. Y y yeah, it's bad. You should be on this ship already. Wait, why is the ship steaming? What the hell? That's, uh, that's odd. Huh. 
I don't trust that. <laughs> I don't trust that at all. But it don't matter. Anyway, so we can come around here. <clears throat> so it's funny. Uh, I should be talking about this a little bit because this was the reason I started Lost playing Dead Space. But there's been some more and more information coming out as to why uh, Visual Games was shut down. Virtual Studios, you know, whatever. Uh, there's a few reasons for that. Um, I think one of them was for a recent blunder that they had when pushing a game out. Forget what it was, but I'll talk about it later. Ow. <laughs> oh no, he got shot by an EA executive. Makes sense. Oh no, I, I, I remember now. I think one of the reasons that Visual Studios was ultimately shut down was because of uh, the failure of Dead Space 3. I'll, I'll mention that later. Trust me, I will definitely mention that later. So, yeah, unless the scientist dude kind of came back to life, there's only one person that could have possibly been on that ship and killed him. Fucking Kendra. Sorry, Isaac. No, you're not. I couldn't let him go through with it. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. <sighs> we even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for helping me find him, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Who's your employer again? I don't remember. Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker. A true alien artifact recovered on Earth. Yeah, the black marker. <clears throat> they dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to each of seven and activated it. And you've seen the result. Well, it's been a few results, actually. The system. I think maybe I could it. No one would have been the wiser. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. Are they not your employers? Still alive. Time was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. <laughs> okay. See you around. Yeah, you can see why I have issues with her. You know, I have issues with you. Help us now. I'm I'm in the flight control room. Neat. Please, Isaac, hurry. Please. I love you. Ah, God. The more I play this game, the more I realize that if I was in Isaac's shoes, I just would not trust anything that happened in front of my eyes because holy fuck no. Alright, so Kendra backstabbed us. I don't get until I understand that though, because so there's two main factions that are fighting for control of the markers. There's the CEC, which is EarthGov. I'm pretty sure CEC is EarthGov. And the church. Uh, the... Unitologist? Yeah, the Unitologist. So, it's like... She said that the CEC d fucked this shit up, but that would basically be her employers. And she's not working for the, the, the Unitologist, because she would have... Maybe she was a bounty hunter working for the, the Unitologist? I don't know. But frankly, like how that happened in the first place, I'm, I'm not, I'm a little, I don't know, I'm a little lost on some of the details. But that's just me, honestly. Anyway, so, yay, hitboxes. <laughs> Rip. Okay. All of these healing items, but nothing I can really do with any of them. That's a shame. All right. 